Other matters, we have Inspector General of Police, the Director of Public Prosecution, Director of Criminal Investigations, rather, and the Attorney General are once again facing another legal tassel. On KTN News Center, we highlighted, rather, KTN News, we highlighted why Boynet and Kihara Karaoke are in court over the police salaries dispute. Now, the trio is the backbone of a constitutional petition challenging the legality of posting pictures of suspects and arrested persons on social media. And as KTN's crime reporter Brian Obuya reports, the DCI and the Inspector General of Police have been ordered to henceforth stop the practice pending the hearing of the case in March next year. That's 2019. In the supporting affidavit of Henry Namiti Shitandi, a petitioner pegging his petition on nine sections of the Constitution, including Article 22 on the Enforcement of Bill of Rights, Article 28 on Human Dignity, Article 31 on Privacy, and Article 49 on the Rights of Arrested Persons, argues that the booking photos convey a strong connotation that the arrested persons are guilty and thus negating the presumption of innocence as set out in Article 50, subsection 2 of the 2010 Constitution. The practice of booking photographs being uploaded on social media sites of the DCI has the effect of hampering with the professional progress of the accused person. Shitandi argues that it may be difficult for arrested persons to apply and get employed even after being acquitted by the courts. Shitandi, through his lawyers, Kiro Koske and company advocates have told the court that the presumption of innocence supersedes public interest and as such, even if booking photos are released for public interest, an accused person's guilt or innocence can only be assured or guaranteed through a court of law. The lawyer argues that Boynet and the DCI's conduct of taking booking photos is not sanctioned by any law and therefore it is unconstitutional that the National Police Service Act No. 11A of 2011 Part 7 does not make provisions of taking booking photos. Pending the hearing of the case before Lady Justice Wilfrida Okwani, a case that has been slated for the 5th day of March 2019, Boynet, Kihara Karaoke and George Kinoti have until the 21st of December to file their responding affidavits. Meanwhile, the High Court sitting in Nairobi has ordered the DCI and Boynet to cease posting booking photos of arrested persons on social media. The public has previously continued to congratulate the police for their arrests and what appears to be a strengthened capacity in handling cases. However, that very public has come out strongly to condemn the DCI for what it terms as a selective way of dispensing justice, questioning why the DCI has not paraded booking photos of government officials it has arrested in the recent purge against the runaway corruption slowly but surely eating the country.